the beeping is actually coming from an hourly alarm that we can easily turn on by accident. Keep in mind the button placement and the icons that you see on my watch may be different, but all these steps apply to most, if not all, of the other watches. So I'm gonna press the mode button once. So it's the same button that we toggle from the different watch modes and the alarm. So I'm gonna press it once to bring up that alarm session. Now, if I press on my end, it says on my watch, it says stop and start. If I press that button once, see the icon on the top left hand corner, that's the alarm. No matter which watch you have, your first icon should be the alarm, the regular alarm. So where you see 605, that's for that. If I press the start and stop button a second time, it'll bring up that hourly alarm. That'll be the second icon that we see come up. So I know it's hard to focus on, on my icon, but just keep in mind it's a second icon. It doesn't matter what it looks like. So you really don't need to see it on my end. All right, and if you press it a third time, that start and stop button, it turns on both the alarms. So the hourly alarm and the alarm for whichever time you have set here. So to turn it off, I think we're on the fourth press, it should turn it off. So let's go through it in one motion. I'm gonna press the start and stop button once. The first alarm for the time that we have set here twice the hourly alarm that we're trying to turn off three times it turns both the alarms on fourth time it turns everything off so most likely on your end you have to turn everything off if you don't want any of the alarms on but if you do want the regular alarm to wake up at a certain time or whatever you need it for just press that start stop button once then after that you can press the mode button again and you shouldn't have this problem, but that's all I got for you. Much love to each and every one of you. I'm your downloading pirate, and I'm out.